is firmly in the lead for the world title. The workshop at Bishop Stortford of agricultural engineer Norman Furneaux. And Mr. Furneaux himself. He's a man with an idea, a new kind of implement for gardeners and farm workers. It would be handy for disabled people too, because the point of the invention is that you can dig with it and you don't have to bend your back. So far, Mr. Furneaux has only made 12 of his new forks, but he plans full-scale production. The implement will sell for about seven pounds. There's a lot of backbending going on down in Somerset, where the Camelot Research Committee is digging for the court of King Arthur. Here at South Cadbury, they're probing 1,400 years into the past to find the truth about Britain's legendary king, who it is said will come again to save England at some time of mortal peril. The remains of a fortress of a Celtic warlord, who might be Arthur, are now being uncovered. These students are cleaning some of the artefacts which have so far been found. Fragments of Celtic pottery, a Roman coin, an Iron Age ring. So far, they've only uncovered a minute part of the ancient site. In this factory at St. Albert's